The best advice that I could give you about gardening in May is to swap out all those traditional type crops that you're used to for their more heat tolerant or subtropical versions. As an example, I love to grow cucumbers. I grow tons of market and pickling cucumbers straight through my fall, winter, and spring, but those don't do too well during the summer. Instead, I changed to growing the Asian cultivars. So if you ever see a cucumber variety that says Japanese this or Chinese that, they're awesome. They have a very high heat tolerance and disease resistance, plus they're super productive. Some of my personal favorites is Soyu Nishiki, China Jade, and Japanese Long. They're a little bit longer and thinner than what you're used to, but their texture is super crunchy and they have more flavor and sweetness. This is just one example. There are lots of other traditional crops that have substitutions that are very similar to them, but grow better during the summer. And if you need seeds, I definitely have a ton on my website.